Hi right, everybody, welcome back to Baldur's Gate 3. So, I did a little bit of uh, research on those two dudes that keep popping up. And what I thought it was, was because of this, but then I was like, no, because this says it's if you fall unconscious, then one pops up when you die. And apparently it's bugged to where if you heal, or rest, or do anything, they just pop up. Um, now I read that doing bestow curse, or uh, you know, take uh, whatever makes the curse go away, um, will make them pop up, you kill them, and then I think you're done. Um, so I wanted to do that, and then grab Gale. Uh, afterwards the only thing is like around here there is not an area where there's no people let's go over here maybe the steel watch will get involved in the fight damned hypocrite oh whoops the blade of frontiers all pomp and empty oaths the sword coast's most dashing fraud I trusted you. I believed in you. Floric, what do you want about? What is this? Lady Mazura told me everything. How you slaughtered your own father. How you crave his power. I thought you were going to save him. But you abused his current state to get rid of him. What a bitch. You mean to make the city bow to you and you alone. That meddling ghoul. Thoric, I... Save it. My duty is to Baldur's Gate, and it holds no place for Raven God's treacherous spawn. Raven God could still be alive, and we intend to save him. Yeah. And plus, yeah, we found you in prison. You given up, so who's the hypocrite? It's like, what the fuck is this bitch doing? At ease. We saved you, stupid ass. Fucking asshole. By the living gods, I believe you. What darkness has fallen upon us? Well, there's something you must know. I should have told you sooner, but I'd hoped somehow your father would return to us. He knew about the Absolute. I thought little of it at first, but he realized the danger before anyone else did. He understood that if the cult were successful in raising an army, Boulder's Gate would be doomed. Before the Absolute has subducted him, he told me that should he fall, I must seek you out and give you this message. Your father trained you in the ways of great champions. You are to use those lessons to wake the worm under the city. He is oath-bound to answer your call and come to our aid. A worm? Are you saying there's a dragon living under the city? A bronze dragon, yes. He sleeps beneath us even now, awaiting a hero to rouse him. The worm goes by many names. Ansur, the waiting storm, the heart of the gate. He promised Balduran he'd protect the city if ever its existence was threatened, but just the once. Since then, the city faced countless threats, but the Baldorians overcame them all. There was never any need to call upon the worm, but this time, things are different. This is the greatest threat Baldur's Gate ever faced. Your father was right. We need Unsaur's help. With him gone, the worm's awakening now falls to you. Take this. The legend of Ansur, an ancient epic ill-remembered, dismissed as a mere tale. Let it set the path before you. Your faith and will is well founded. We will seek the worm and ask for his help. Thank you. 
and darkness. I see your light. I will go and assemble any allies I can find. When the battle horns call, we'll stand ready. Unleash the worm, Will. Let his tempest swallow the absolute and its allies. Good luck. The legend of Anthro. That was weird. Curse that rotten devil and her forked tongue, trying to set Floric against me. She's a damnable inferno of chaos. What matters now is that Floric saw sense, and we know our path forward. We'll finish what my father couldn't. We'll awaken Ansur, the heart of the gate. Do you really think a dragon's been living under Baldur's Gate? I do, and so did my father. Go on, read the legend of Ansur. Then we can plan our next steps. Could it be true, Duke still main allied with the Emperor? Mind flayers are like devils. They just sport tentacles rather than wings. Clever, manipulative, exploitative. The Emperor says he's a friend. I think we'd be fools to believe him. And maybe it's true. Maybe Stelmain allied with a mind flayer and subjected the city to their political will. Or maybe he made an offer she couldn't refuse. The Emperor promises incredible powers if we're willing to vote. Uh, we got that. But what, what are this ritual stuff? Coin of Mammon, Infernal Marble, Diamond, Incense, and a Skull. What? What do I have this? I mean, I know I have the Infernal Marble. I guess I'll keep this stuff on me. The Legend of Answer. Baldur's Gate, Great Baldurin's Birth, O Baldurin, Founder do veneration. His guardian dragon answer, tremendous in worth. A savior below our eternal elation. To worm way neath prison's deepest level. To be found by not a soul nor devil. Note, entrance in worm's rock prison? You are. With a lightning shock, a true hero's spark flickers. The torches alight, and worm's eyes shall awake a glitter. Note. Something about sparks and torches? Use lightning skills? It's trials no common adventure may exceed, when each day sends forth new ones to their fates. But one great hero, by the Founder's will decreed, shall only once grant our age the heart of the gate. Note, only a great hero can pass the trials and awaken answer. What's this of a true hero's spark? Investigate the murders. We saved Cora Highbury from the boss. Serial killer disguised as a wine merchant. Figaro Pennygood is next on the target list. We need to find him before the killer does. Yes. Free Orpheus. Great to help us get to Raphael's house of hope in the hills. She gave us an own grimoire that outlines steps for a ritual to open a portal. We should follow the instructions. Reach the house of hope. Hellsick, the diabolist. Gauntlets, kill giant strength, big read the deal. She gave us a note with precise instructions. We should follow them. And then the blade. Great worm answer resides in a secret lair called the Wormway. The entrance is apparently located somewhere within Worm's Rock Prison. And the notes inside it hint that opening the way involves lightning sparks and torches. Okay, let's go ahead and quick save before. We try to do this. We'll go down here just in, you know, maybe he'll help. Um, we should have... Nothing? Uh, what about this? Scroll of Bisto, yeah. Why would that not come up? Designated citizens, please stand still for evaluation. It's me and Karlak. It is removed. Hey, 
Who are they hitting? Hey, and good thing they are helping, so I, I did the right thing. They were hitting this guy. Fist. Fisty. You missed? What use are you? Oh, we were all surprised. Yeah. Except for... Carlac. Oh, sorry. But... I mean, shoot. No, he's still got 80. I was going to say, they might kill him before I even get a chance. Um, let's see. I thought we had... That's right, it's only uh, right there. But we could still blind him. Oh, never mind. We could still miss. I'm heating up. Come on, Steel Watch. Miss again. He still, I guess he got 12. Forty five, damn. Good thing she gets three. Thanks, fellas. What? I can't loot them? Rescue Orn's victims. Destroy the Steel Watchers. We defeated the Steel Watcher. Gortash now had one fewer mechanical. No, he didn't. He's right here. Then one of their fist guys died. Um, but anyway. We need this one on Karlak now. Damn, he goes for us first. He has missed every time. These people are useless. God, 162. I guess being under this bridge wasn't great since I can't see hardly anything. Man, he is only going for Karlak. Oh, he is ensnared. Really, 70% in your mess. He shouldn't get to attack again, so that's a good thing. Ah. Blood comes easy these days. Okay. Carlac's the only one that even got hit there. We don't have the curse anymore. Would she still need 30?
And I'll tell you what, since we are right here, we should, let's grab Gale. Just so we can do this, because really we don't need Will until, let's see, is it on the map? Whoops, didn't mean to do that. Um, I guess we can do this. Yeah, until we go to the, um, that prison, we don't really need ma uh, Will. So let's grab Gale. Because obviously we're keeping us in the group, but I also just want, I want to keep these two because Carlac, I don't, you know, she's a big hitter and, you know, um, Burn yourself. I'm trying to think. She's a big hitter. She's able to carry a guy just so much. Um, and then Lizelle is our. Like, if we didn't have her, she wouldn't be hitting. Or we wouldn't be hitting nearly as much. Um, bitch, Mizera. Uh, let's see. Give uh, a bunch of stuff to Gale. Now, give that to Gale, see, you know, how it does for him. class is this? I mean, what a... I guess it's none. Increase your dexterity by two. Let's see if Gale can wear that. I think Gale has to have a crossbow. Damn it all! We've got to get Halsin back! If that means killing Gortash, nothing would give me greater pleasure. Let's talk. About the Legend of Answer. It's not just a legend. It's a history. Consider this. To worm way me prison's deepest level. That must mean Worm's rock prison. That's where we'll find the entrance to this worm way. Then this, with the shock of a true hero's spark flickers, the torches are light, and Worm's eye shall awake a glitter. To open the way, we'll need to spark torches. This dragon, Ansor, was Baldurin's ally. We'd be fools to let him sleep while the dead three's chosen raised the city. Are you sure? The blade stands at the right and just... Okay. Uh, we'll talk to everybody as well. I don't know how exactly Orin managed to spirit away someone as big as Halsin, 
But we have to get him back. Either via a rescue, or Gortash's death. Something on your mind? You know exactly what's on my mind. Florica accosted us in the lower city. What in the hells did you tell her? Why, only the truth. That you bear the blame for the Duke's untimely demise. Such a loyal servant of the city. So eager to hear of your exploits. Tell me, darling, how is she? Alive, no thanks to you. I convinced her to stand down. What a relief. It would be a shame if she'd struck down the one and only blade. Can we just Alas, kill her? She misses the fallen duke. Someone will need to step up in his absence. A man with the spirit of a dragon. His only son. Perhaps. I don't get it. If Will isn't your warlock, why stick around and give him power? The Absolutists worked a number on me at Moonrise. And you're the best hope I've got at payback. No one crosses the Hell's children without getting scorched. You left Karlak alone, didn't you want her dead? What changed? Oh, you are an inquisitive one. I'd have thought you'd figured by now. Zariel found new use for an old battle axe. The dead three in that bulging brain of theirs are a threat to more than this trifling city, you know. Savor her company. Who's to say when Zariel might change her mind? My mistress can be so capricious. What can you tell me about the hells? The nine hells of Beator. Each its own domain. Each with its own archdevil to rule it. I call the first hell my home, Avernus, my mistress Zariel's realm, a torrid battleground split by the bloody waters of the Styx. How I adore it, the delicious agony of it all. The other eight, well, they are pleasures unto themselves. Perhaps I'll show you myself, if I deem you worthy. You never told me how the absolute sh absolution has captured you. Correct. I didn't. If you must know, I was scouting the cultists on behalf of Zariel. But those cursed shadows were thick enough to fell even a half-fiend. I woke in that damned pod. It kept my body sealed and my most powerful magic silenced. But a brave, kind, benevolent soul set me free. Gallantry isn't dead, after all. If you're gonna be staying, I need something in return. Why? I'm supplying Will with every scrap of his infernal power. I've paid my dues many times over. I tell you what, when the time comes to squish that big baddie of a brain, I'll lend you a hand. Alright. I guess that's good enough. Hey, Scratch. I need to find a way forward. Voss is waiting beneath the city. We'll apprise him of our progress once we have the Orphic Hammer in hand. Have you thought about making the Emperor's Astro Touch Tab go away? Nothing really yet. Talk to these two for a sec. Come to bask in the glow of the Moon Maiden's sword? Be most welcome. How do you intend to spend... Okay. Same thing. Keeping very well, I hope. I believe those are the same things as well. Oh, in here. Put my hands on everything. Nothing. She 
thinks she can take my druid and live to tell the tale? Dream on, shapeshifter. Karlak's coming for you. Damn right we are. Soldier? So far, the only person we... What the fuck was that? We really don't know... Crumpled note, scrawled in blood. A letter from Orin. Gortash's metal mannequins will not dance to your tune. They only dance to his. To set yourself against their steel is to invite domination. So why slice the strings of one when you might take might make one cut to sever them all? Seek the blackened heart of their foundry and tear it out. Then the Lordling will play puppet master no more, Warren. Weird. Okay, I'm gonna be grabbing Asteria or uh, Gale. Let's talk to Yenna. I brought my own paring knife. Now I just need some ingredients, and I'm gonna make something really good. I promise. Cool. Open up. Uh, oh, I wonder if they. No. Damn. I wish that was something that they. Upgraded or updated. I they should have it to where if you're in camp, you can just use all ingredients that everybody in your party has, or in your in your camp has, and the stuff in your chest. That would be an amazing update. Cause it's like I can't carry all that shit around. It's too heavy. So. We kill Gortash, or Halson dies. It is not an easy call. On the one hand, killing Gortash would be fun. On the other, Halson can be very annoying. <laughs> hmm. We probably should save the druid, though. He does have his uses. I forgot we gave Asterion some cool ass armor. Yes. Let's talk about the Astral Touch Tadpole. Don't look at me like that. I know what you're going to say. The answer is no. No. Enter his mind. Tempt him with the wonders of your newfound form. Unlike you, W, it's so unwilling to receive a new power. That was before I knew the cost. Before I knew it meant transforming into some grotesque beast i remember how it hurt when i turned into a vampire my body writhed and warped while i was utterly helpless the grip of death owned my heart as it beat its last i, I don't want to turn into anything else i can't do that again I can't watch my body be taken over. You're afraid? I am not. I just don't want to lose my God's given good looks, really. Wouldn't that be a crime? Your oath of the powers are the only reason you can stand up to Kazador. This will help you defeat him. I'm really not sure. Let's do the wisdom. Oh god, we need an 18. Okay. Nat 20. As you pick apart his mind, you discover his worst memory. That which brings him the purest terror. Complete solitude after being disobedient. Sealed, buried alive voiceless will this be forever a year of horror then the release 
he will never disobey again. You never want to risk that again, even if it means becoming part of it. That forgotten wretch is who you'll be again unless you become more. I want you to become part of it to protect yourself. Damn it. Damn you. All right. I'll do it. <laughs> um... Where are the worms? I just want to give them so that when we do get him in the group, he can um, start using them. Where are they? I have two. Oh, maybe they are. Are they just with mine? That wouldn't be good. I thought maybe they'd be in the jarred jars. Halcyn does not deserve to die on such a craven's altar. We should consider Orin's terms carefully, however distasteful we may find them. Go ahead. I'm listening. With pleasure. Lead on. Okay, and he's got some level ups. Oh, he has a lot of level ups. <laughs> he gets two spells. Banishment, Blight, Confusion, Elemental. And flames that shed light in a three minute radius provide resistance to fire or cold damage or retaliate against melee attacks. Let's grab that. Odalux Resilient Sphere. Enclose the target in a sphere of shimmering force, blocking all incoming damage and spell effects. Oh. That seems pretty good. Maybe we'll get another thing and we'll get that one. Um, I want either Blight. Or the Minor Elemental. Grab light. And he gets a feat. Let's see. He could do ability. What's his at? He could go up. Wow. He honestly should because of his. Yeah. His intelligence needs to go up one. And then, let's see. Constitution is hit points and saving throws and plus two to constant constitution. And then dexterity to constitution. That way his uh, spells are better affected. Two spells. Cloud kill. You can reposition the cloud every turn. Yeah. And then what was the other one I wanted? The elemental. Well, here's a better one. Cantrip. The hell? Acid splash. Throw a bowl of acid that damages each creature it hits. Yeah, might as well, honestly. I think we have. Prevent the target from healing until your next turn. An undead target receives disadvantage. Ooh. Let's grab that because of that dude. We're going to have to kill eventually. Two more spells, man. I said hold is so good. I don't want 
point our binding as well. Grab that one. That way if somebody really needs to not die. Okay, two more spells. Arcane Gate, create two linked teleportation portals. Interesting. Chain Lightning, strike an enemy with lightning. Three more bolts will leap from the target, electrifying as many as three other enemies within. Circle of Death, sculpt a massive sphere of entropic energy around a creature. Devastate the target and all surrounding creatures. Disintegrate. Shoot a thin green ray from your finger. If the 5200 force damage reduces the target to zero, it disintegrates into a crumbly ash. But why does that matter, disintegrate? You know. Man, you get so many cool things as a wizard. Lovely day this. For now. Okay, so right now he only has these. What's this? Netherless or oh yeah, it's that thing we uh we won't be using. Let's look at his spell book. Because we can take out Witch Bolt. Um, and put in what we want. Honestly, take out Web. It's only 3 to 18. It's the thing with that. Okay, but what do we want? See, the thing about the magic missile, it just doesn't do much damage. So it's like 6 to 15. It's... It's really not that... that useful. I'm gonna take it out. Uh, Thunder Wave can always be useful just for knocking them back. Put the elemental in there. So we have three big ones that I really would like to put in there. I have a... Thing for this. I'll tell you what, too, he really doesn't have very many cantrips, which is crazy. Like, he has one.
Man, I really want this in there. So, hmm. We'll put that in there. Let's see what he has. That's if you're standing in water. Um, he has no other boots. You can, uh, with long bows and short bows, in addition your ranged weapon attacks do an additional two damage. Okay. Pretty sure that means that he's, yeah, he's now he's not official with that, but he can use this, and it does basically the same. He'll do a little, slightly less with his ranged, but he has a he has a ton of you know um, he has a thunder and a lightning. Uh, doesn't really have a radiant. We took we didn't take that one, but oh well. I think increases his dexterity and jump. That goes down to 13. 12, okay, so it is better. Um, we don't really, we have one poison, so that wouldn't, we'd only be able to do it once or twice. And that's just stealth plus one, and then his cape, armor class saving throw, pretty good. Uh, no other capes. Helmet, at the start of combat, the wear against momentum. That's armor. Okay, those are all pretty good. Resistance to poison. Movement speed. I think that's it. The absolute should be a thing of the past, and I with it. Yet, at the risk of angering Mr. Fervor, I'm glad it didn't come to that, given what has come to light. What are you talking about? The Elder Brain. But, more importantly, the crown that it wore. Even without seeing it for myself, I could sense it. Netherese magic. So pure, so complete. I doubted what I was feeling at first. Most Netherese artifacts contain only the faintest amount of their former power. The ghost of an echo of a memory. That crown was different. I can't fathom how such a wonder survived. Surely everything of its ilk was destroyed along with Netheril itself, but no matter, it exists. I must learn more of it. Back up a little. Why is this crown so important all of a sudden? That crown sits on a gargantuan elder brain bent on destroying us and everything we hold dear. Understanding its true nature might unlock the means of our victory. 
We need to learn more about what we saw. An artifact as powerful as that crown must have been documented somewhere. As luck would have it, we'll soon find ourselves near one of the finest book collections this side of Candlekeep. Sorcerer's Sundries. I need to go there and learn all I can. Oh, you're in luck because we're there. Why would a Baldurian magic shop be the first place we look? Ha! Sorcerer's Sundries is no mere trading post. It's been serving the arcane community for centuries. Their collection of rare tomes is unparalleled. I mean, leathery sex are hardly commonplace, but I'm certain they'll have one or two stashed away. You'll have to forgive my eagerness, but if my suspicions prove to hold water, this could be the answer to all our problems. Okay, well, you're in luck because we're there. <laughs> Don't waste a step. Oh, another... Sure. Come get your copy of the boldest mouth gazette. When the mouth speaks, the city shakes. All right there, Chief. Can I interest you in a copy of our fine, fine broadsheet? Sure, why not? Have a gander at that. Come back tomorrow if you fancy fresh news. Arrogant vigilantes brutally murder respected Thorm family. Really? Visit the uncanny Feywild Circus and Worms Crossing for a day of wholesome family fun featuring Lucretius the Necromancer, Mummy Zera, and more. Murder in Baldur's Gate, the mouth investigates. Feywild's Circus comes to town with famous Dribbles the Clown. Well, not anymore. Reports of ships sailing by night along Worms Crossing beaches. Hey, boy. She's out sending them lies, huh? Hello again, Squire. Fancy a copy of today's edition? I already got it. Suit yourself. If you change your mind, I'll be here all... Well, all the time, really. Salamander. Let me back hey, in. it's this guy. I'll bring Laroakin out here, you tin tube. You tell Laroakin I went for his goddamn night song, and now he has to pay up. What are you looking at? Shit, it's you. You went looking for the night song after me. Please tell me you found it. Sorry, I didn't find anything. Or who are you trying to get it inside? Laroakin, the wizard who set out the contract. He owns this place. And his little page boy inside knows how to get to him. Laroakin said it'd be easy money. A smash and grab. Get in, get the night song, go. Turns out his little relic was in a temple of Shah. Beneath an army of goblins. Would never have taken my people in if I'd known. I can't bring them back. But I can make Laroakin cough up. Especially if you found the relic. I found the night song. Turns out it wasn't a relic, but an Azimar. An Azimar? Hells. If I'd known. I'd have asked for more gold. Kidnapping costs more than theft. Don't forget, I'm the one who gave you that contract. I want my cut. Deception. She's gone. I'm not sure where to. Or intimidation. Piss off. Uh, she's in my camp. If you want to turn her in, you're gonna have to take her down yourself. I haven't been paid yet. She's immortal and tough. You can forget about turning her in for a reward. Uh, she's gone. Yeah, and only two ones. 
two ones are the only thing we would lose. Son of a bastard's whore. You had a small fortune in your grasp, and you let it go. I ought to knock some sense into you. But you know what? I'm too goddamn tired. If she's out there, I'm gonna find her. You mark my words. And you'll die. Crab. Roland. What the fuck? You. What do you want? It's good to see you too, Roland. Please just make your purchase and go. I don't have energy for anything else. Let me see what's on offer. Be quick about it. What's up with Roland? Uh, let's see if we have anything to sell. Charisma plus two up to twenty two. That's very good for us. This is light armor. You gain plus one to spell save. Green bed regeneration. When starting your turn on plant growth surface or vine surface, regain one d four hit points. Advantage on constitution saving throw checks. I mean that's good if you only start on plant growth or vines. What? Whenever the wearer succeeds on a saving throw against a spell, they regain one to four hit points. The wearer can use a reaction to make an unarmed strike against any attacker that misses. That'd be good for somebody who does unarmed. At the beginning of your turn, the ring activates and heals you. How much is this? Quick spell gloves. Cantrips. That cost an action. Cost a bonus action instead. This effect can be used once per short rest. That can be pretty good as well. What? I have information on the night song. I want to speak to Lorican. Be very sure before you make to visit the Roican. He's got a beastly temper. But if you really do know something, he'll want to see you. Head upstairs. You can find a way into his tower up there. What is up with Roland? What does this hat look like? I don't know. Well, whatever. Um, set the words dexterity to score to eighteen. The enchantment has no effect. It's our dexterity is worth higher without it. What is our dexterity without these gloves? 16.
Where are my gloves go? Cantrips. But it can only be used once per short rest, so let's give these to Gale and see. Because he has this cantrip, which could be, I mean, it can be decent. That's what sucks. Like, he really does not have very many cantrips. She has some good ones. What's reverberation again? Negative one penalty to strength, dexterity, and constitution saving throws per remaining turn. When the entity has five or more turns of rever reverberation, it takes one to four thunder damage, possibly falls prone. The condition is removed afterward. Creatures immune to thunder damage can't receive reverberation. Hmm. Let's give them. Let's give them those instead. So that's progress. I'm sure you'll manage. It's not as difficult as a vengeance. I shouldn't have to wait until I've got nothing left. Something good here. Other times for me, I know. Magic on the Wii, we have read that. Ye Follies of Carsus. This ancient water damage tome is largely illegible except for the following. Did Carsus Mystic Autodidact in, uh, in all his vainglory, disdainful as ever, received? I'm not reading this. That was. That first sentence was ridiculous. Pretty sure we read that one. Enchanted me. This book describes an elderly spellcaster's years learning the art of enchantment. Cold and frigid was the day I learned that to fail in charming a better wizard was the most dangerous game of all. I first met Cavalier and Draithwaite at a Kalishite bar barroom. The game was a complicated play of cards I hadn't mastered, but being young, foolhardy, and, all, and over confident in my abilities as a student wizard. I thought I'd use my minimal talents with enchantment to gain the upper hand. Quietly did I seek to charm the feeble old woman to my left. She appeared to me a paracile sort and unlikely to put up much resistance to my trick. I've been blown against the back barroom's back wall, then up to the ceiling and back down before I realized this feeble woman was none other than Cavalier and Braithwaite, Master of Charms, author of the very textbook from which I learned the enchantment. I attempted to use against her. After she gave me a good thrashing for my audacity, we became lifelong friends. Right. If not over, then through. I just think we should be careful what we say in public as well. Might be useful. I can have a mind flare parasite. Shelves of 
practically pink behind. Just don't rub it up. Some people are so selfish. Blood stop. Is this a sign of hobby? Mother's leap by Volo can get on himself. Typical. How delightful. Not I simply must have it. Their hands and be you. Oh no. Why aren't they rushing in? Oh. Downfall of the Iron Throne. We've read that, I believe. And then Fables of Pharaoh and won the Dim Witted Drow. We've definitely read that. It must have some sort of merit if the social sun stops it. Well, at least they seem to use the. It was a dead person. Okay. Surge! Oh, never mind. Oh, it's a zombie now. You're after nothing but the best. And luckily for you, that's exactly what I The Shadow We we read that. Is this the lady? Just think of the Do you think that zombie looks fresh? Is fresh good? This isn't the lady we say. I never right? know zombies. From the hag. No. Newborn zombie gazes at you hungrily, pus drooling from its slack jaw. I wonder if we're ever gonna find that lady again. An alternative perspective, the weave. Hello. Again, I wish there was a way to know if you've read a book before. Alright, let's get away from the water elemental because we're somehow getting hurt. Spider. Welcome, dear patron, to the floor at the top of the stairs. If you have information about the night song, great riches await. If you are here to waste the great wizard Laroican's time, reconsider. Let your knowledge determine your path forward. Four portals. The night song is an immortal being, the child of a deity. The night song is a priceless ruby Two. from a realm beyond our own. The night song is an ancient potion that allows its drinker to become irresistibly attractive to man and god alike. The night song is a druidic star oh, we that know allows its bearer command over I didn't realize that we needed beasts. the Thoric Codex and Sorcerer Sunders. Is that a book we gotta buy? I should speak up. What? Be quick about it. Shut up, Roman. No, it's not a book. Have to wait until I've got nothing left. Why should we prepare? We all must 
Oh, we can look for it later. The night song is an immortal. Uh, Craig's aim is much improved, but uh, still leaves something up to chance. Yes, sir. Uh... All right, Crank. Ready? Aim. Oh. Mm. We have a visitor. At ease. McClaw, you may go. I see no night song. Uh, surely you wouldn't have entered my tower without the night song in hand. Surely you wouldn't have wasted my time. Not quite the enthusiastic welcome I was hoping for. You'll have more gratitude than you know how to count once the night song is in my hands. Do you have it or not? What do you want with her? She? Then you do know her. You've been to Shah's temple. To the Shadowfell. You've looked upon the Night Song's face. Tell me, and choose your next words carefully. Where is she now? Deception. I regret to inform you the Night Song is no more killed in the Sharan temple where she was held. Another deception. I've seen her. She was trapped by Catheric Thorm. I left her there. Intimidation. Get out of my face. Deception. I know nothing. I swear it. Uh, I know where she is. I might even be willing to tell you. Why do you want her so badly? Be careful what you wish for. She'll eat you alive. Why do you want her so badly? I'm growing tired of this repartee, my friend. Let us cut to the chase. Beautiful, isn't it? Worth more than your life, too. I bought it from a Kalashite warlock. Very little of his soul left to him. Hmm. It can bind a celestial to the wearer's service with a snap of the fingers. And this... This can keep her in place. Forever. Hmm. Bard, binding the night song forever. How unoriginal. Need I recite the tale of Catheric Thorn? It didn't work out for poor Catheric, did it? He was a fool, a desperate mercenary who hoard out his soul to whichever god flattered him. 
I serve no god, but that which stares back at me in the mirror. The night song will be put to a grand purpose, equalizing man and god. Whoever helps me attain that which I seek will be greatly rewarded. There is more to divinity than lifespan. Ensnaring an immortal won't make you a god. Of course not. But perhaps, after enough lifetimes, I might make a start of it. He would seek the power of gods for the pettiest of reasons. His own gratification. At least I seek them for the better of all. Uh, what's that? I didn't quite catch the words, but the insolent tone was clear enough. Uh, pitying, not insolent. You chase one power without knowing an even greater one lies within my reach. The crown of Carsus. Once we acquire it, your ambitions will be dwarfed. I'll be able to stand against Mistra and wrest her powers from her for the betterment of all. The crown of Carsus? Nonsense. Even if it still existed, you couldn't possibly handle its power. <laughs> Perhaps you could not. But Netheril's power is in my blood. And Mistra? I know her in ways that most mortals can only dream of. Ah. Uh -huh. So it is you. Mistra's discarded lapdog. And now you think your bark is cause to make me tremble? There is no need for me to bark. My actions will speak for themselves. In time. Then go. Ax. I'll open a fine vintage in your name. Once word of your failure reaches me. I regret to inform you that Night Song is no more. Killed in the Sharan Temple where she was held. And look, we get a plus five now from Charisma. Let's quick save. Dead? That cannot be. She, it, is immortal. Not anymore, thanks to me. She was a Selenite held by Sharans. Her death was ine inevitable. Is that meant to be some consolation? She, it, was the key to my immortality! How can this be? How can this be? Shit! Oh. Terrible tidings have cost me everything! My grand design! Dash the ruins! This always happens to me! So, saying we should tell her no matter what. So now that we know that he wants her, we can end this conversation, go tell her, and see what she wants to do from there. Then go. 
Axe! I'll open a fine vintage in your name. Once word You aren't the only one who knows what's on offer for the Night Song's retrieval. Consider someone who might slip into your camp at any moment. Or hurry you through street and inn until you're run ragged and surrender. The choice is yours. Fortune? Or imminent death? I know you'll choose wisely. Mother's milk, your visage speaks of ill tidings. Speak, ally mine. What troubles you? A wizard called Lorgan is looking for you. Is he indeed? Pray tell, what does he seek from Dame Aelin? All I know is that he's put out a contract for your capture. He seemed to seem to braggart, braggart in a fool. I wouldn't worry about him. Seems dangerous. I think we ought to put an end to him. He put out a bounty for your capture, and now there's a violent mercenary looking for you. Let them come, and let them find me. Dame Aelin will strike down any who seek to bring her to harm's home. Yet, it is better to cut off the head of the snake than to let its slithering snakeling swarm us unabated. This wizard... This wizard must be held to account. I will wring his neck until he's dead. Let's take him down together. Oh, his end will be one more strand in the great braid of our friendship. I'm coming with you. I'd like to get a few licks in myself. My darling, we agreed you'd scout for the nearest Salunite Enclave this very night. Let us divide our efforts, all the sooner to be reunited. I won't let you go alone. Who knows what this wizard might have planned? Our closest ally will accompany me, won't you? It will be a swift and fruitful chore. Hie we to this Leroican right away. I am as eager to meet him as he is to ensnare me. Yes, let's go. Kill this jackass. Swift as my feet can carry me. Aha! I spy a wizard foul. What have we here? A magician in a tower? Hiding away from the frightening world. What are you so scared of, Magus? Not the Night Song, surely? Why, she's nothing but a relic to be purchased and pursued. My God. The Night Song is a person. At last. There you are, my dear. You will address me with due deference. I am Dame Aelin. And you are a whelp without honor, without pride, with nothing but a tower full of trinkets. Oh, my apologies, Dame Aelin. I meant no disrespect. I asked our mutual friend here to make an introduction that I might get to meet the famed daughter of Saluna. Forgive me for that impudence. Perhaps our friend can bridge the gap and do what I believe they came here to do? I came to stop you, Lorgan. My steel-hearted friend speaks true. Give me one good reason, Magus, why I should not strike you down where you stand. Huh. Dame Aelin, I have discovered 
a device that would allow your immortality to be shared. It would cause you no harm, no pain of any kind. You serve your mother, Saluna, I believe. She who has blessed our realm with so many gifts. Honor her by sharing yours. You dare to threaten me with the same magic that held me in torment for a hundred years? You do not seek to share my gifts. You seek to poach them. <laughs> I had hoped to appeal to your better nature. Perhaps I overestimated you. Hmm. No bother. I have an arsenal of implements capable of convincing you to see reason. It's over for you, wizard. You can't overpower both of us. You can have the immortal. Uh, final reward will be much easier. A pity you didn't prove a more reliable ally. You could have reaped the rewards of my good favor. I'd hoped to keep an open mind, but it seems you're determined to make this as difficult as possible. Boy, at the ready. Once I've taken control of the Asima, she must go directly into the caging runes. My magic is yours to command, Master Leroican. Simply say the word. I have great plans for you, Dame Aelin. And if you will not go quietly, then you'll go kicking and screaming. <laughs> Magicians and their plans for Dame Aelin. Predictable, sadistic, flaccid. <laughs> you missed. Wow, Gale doesn't get to go for a long time. <laughs> so Roland is against us. Lorican only has ninety eight. A nearby Earth grants the affected entity immunity to poison damage and an additional 324 damage to elemental report. Immunity to cold. Immunity to fire. Immunity to lightning. Okay. But he's vulnerable to psychic. There's nothing against thunder. Oh yeah. Uh... Oh, Roland's right there too. There's this guy too. God damn it, Miklar. I really don't want to hurt Roland, is the thing. How much do they have? 123, 127. F Crank only has 53. He only has 8. 117. Hmm. What would the best thing be? Because he's gonna. Go everything's gonna go before Gale. 
If we are able to hold him though, everything's a crit hit as long as we're next to him. This is my happy place. That'll also hit Lysel, so let's go ahead and do Lysel first. So now we really just need these elementals. It won't hit him as well? No, it will. Oh, it did. Oh, shit. Okay. Oh no, our little buddy's almost dead. I feel like we can help Roland. We got earth, fire, okay so that one wouldn't work on any of them. Really, disadvantage, even though before it was like 80%, still hit him for 18. So. been charmed twice now.
land in my way. We're gonna have to try. This is your end. It's all right. Oh, didn't realize that happened. Okay, so wait, we did hit him. I should get thought she got three. Why she only get two on this? trying to save Roland. <laughs> Close though, only eight. Whatever, Crank. Shouldn't Crank be dead just because the other guy's dead? God damn it. Of course she goes for Roland. I'm sorry, Roland. I know it wasn't your fault.
Say if he runs, she might hit him and kill him, but no, nope, he didn't run. Alright, little buddy, finish him off. He got him. Uh, what's he at? 19. Leroican, you who would see me caged, you who would purchase my submission with profane gold. Let every wicked magus, every vile murtherer, each slaver and misery merchant see. Dame Aelin is watching. She is indomitable, and when her face lights the shadows of your wrongdoing, you are broken by its beauty! God damn. I really hate. Why is Gale not in our party? I really hate that Roland died because I know he was letter from Lorican. You are most fortunate, Roland. Few catch my interest, but your letters demonstrate potential. I am willing to give you a chance. However, a warning: you must be willing to do whatever is necessary. Power is not cheap, and I'll not suffer weakness. And my own student, Lorcan. You gain plus one when starting your turn on plan. Oh, what? Oh, yeah, because we were able to buy it from him. Sorry, Roland. I know it wasn't your fault, buddy. Despair of Athkalta. You gain plus one bonus to spell save. Man, his weapon kind of sucked. Shelter of Altala. Mirror image. You have advantage on saving throws against spells. Yeah, he really didn't have anything. The firehead fool is dead. Yet as I stare upon his corpse, I feel sadness. Why? I know something of sadness, or at least the battles do. What does it feel like? A gripping in the chest. As though I'd lost someone. Something. Uh, uh, Paladin's fatigue, no doubt. You were excellent in battle. As is your way. And I am proud to fight at your side. I will catch my breath. Then to camp I will bring my bones. Moon Maiden be with you. Well, damn. Book Thrown.
traps, please. I honestly didn't think we'd be killing that dude when it was like, we need to go see him. Like, okay. Guess I'll try to help or maybe give us something. Nope. He just wanted power. Get an additional level four spell slot. Go back to Gale. Well, at least we are safe to heal. No more short rests. We do still have the song of rest, though, so that's good. <laughs> Wizards of Note, Lorican, Editor's Edition. This page appears to be a bespoke edition, a bespoke edition, not mass printed like others in the series. A note is affixed to the front page. Dear Sir, though I appreciate your attempt to contribute to our popular series, I'm afraid we are not accepting reader submissions at this time. Furthermore, I would recommend our fact checker, Hope Candor, for your personal employ. Should you wish to attempt to publish this volume under a different name elsewhere, kind regards, Ember Coil. That was... Not exciting. There's probably, I, I bet you anything, if we were to save the people from the oh, ornate letter. Go. Lorcan, I have responded out of respect to my counselor, Baltazar, who advises me that you may prove a loyal ally in the coming fight. I understand you wish to know about the soul cage which binds the night song to me. Details I cannot and will not provide, but the magic itself is necromantic in nature. Designed by my aforementioned counselor, I hope your curiosity is satisfied, General Catheric Thorm. Um, but yeah, I, I bet you anything... That if we were to have gone to Moonrise Towers first and not saved Aelin first, then, you know, and saved all the gnomes and all of the, um, all of the, uh, tieflings. I was forgetting what they were called. I bet you then Roman wouldn't have come over here because he felt so much guilt about not being able to save anybody and all that, so. Why going down? What, what the hell happened there? Uh, let's do Song of Rest. to be here you're about to be ejected right try to convince them you belong here deception why are you looking at me like that I live here congratulations you've convinced them you've been caught trespassing what the fuck again
the basement chest key. Look away, bitch. Just have a few. I guess we can just go invisible. What's this? Harping by moonlight and approach to life. Sorcerer Sundry's basement chest key. What the hell? All of a sudden we are not invisible. An alternative perspective. Oh, we've read, read that. Bottled eye. Don't think we need that. A note from Vaulter. Mikla, as you refuse to speak to the following, the incident with the three-eyed man, I have no choice but to make my request in writing. Master Lorcan instructs you to bring his newly acquired lamp, the one with the gin, to the vault and store it behind the project protective wall. It is far too dangerous to be left on display in the shop proper, Vaulter. Lamp, the one with the gin to the vault. Officious note. Miklar, Master Lorican has requested his tome of divination spells be brought to the basement. He must focus without interruption in order to see the unseen. Since you refuse to speak to me since the incident with the ape, I have no choice but to make my request in writing. Vaulter. Class book. What? Okay. Why does he just automatically get, uh, seen? Having to use three invisibility potions. journal I can endure it I can I don't care I let lyric and bluster and boast even a bragger to his has his uses if I were to leave it would have been for nothing the loss the death the grief impossible that sort of loss doesn't happen without some purpose I am that purpose is that hubris of course but I've nothing left if not my belief in myself and what I can learn what I can do someday soon 
Yeah. If if we would have saved the teeth wings, he wouldn't have come here. Songs are so weird. The path to Carsus. Oh. From the hand of Ramazeth. What glimpse of magic's true import might Silver Hand proffer? Take the promised hand and watch abjuration cross its palm, for you too shall need protection from the purge of Silver's fires. Only through its flames will Carsus' path, path be fit to follow. Oh yeah, we got a bunch of um, stiff. There we go. You've set foot in a restricted area. A swift exit may be in order. Congratulations. It seems the rules have not changed. Okay, so now we need to find the Tharchaic Codex. So that's going to be in the basement. Which I never did find something that said basement. Welcome, dear page. I am an unperson to browse our wares. So if you are a city official here to collect dues, say taxes. For all other inquiries, say other. To learn more about the search for the night song, say night song. To learn more about Master Leroican, say Leroican. To learn more about my good self, I am the product of an ingenious because Master Leroican is engaged in important work. I, the night Master we know Leroican about all this, so I'm is just offering skipping it. He resides the great and powerful Leroican offering our humble group an audience. We are honored. I'm sorry, I didn't to browse our if you are a city official here to collect dues, say you are not Mr. Marvin Hard. The collections officer assigned to this establishment. Trust me, your tax will be put better use in my hands. A one and a four. We still get it. By one. Logic detected. How else can I help you today? Enjoy our unmatched selection. Just grab these now. I have something to ask. Literature department. Can I help you? I'm trying to find out about a particular ne Netherese crown. Have you anything on the subject? Why the whispering first? An environment of quiet reverence. Okay. Is that true? Books are you sensitive? Um, I'm interested in any especially rare tomes you might have. Heard that our library has a collection other shops would lack the skill to curate. Between us, 
Even Master Larokin was reluctant to house them in his tower. The pen is mightier than the magic wand, apparently. <laughs> They're locked away here for their and our customers' safety. Our finest reserve includes the Tharkia Codex, the Annals of Cassius and Netherese Folly, Sites of the Sealy, and the Curriculum of Strategy. Do any of those interest you? All of them. Interesting choice. If I didn't know better, I think you might have the necromancy of Thay in your possession. <laughs> I'd advise tremendous care with the Tharkiat Codex. The cost of unlocking its mysteries is onerous. The Annals of Carsus, the nether, a nether is falling. It is said to be written by Lord Carsus himself, the Netherese arcanist who attempted to replace the goddess Mistra, failed, and was banished for the attempt. Great magical knowledge lies within those pages, but not many can withstand it. That's it. That's what I need. The annals of Carsus would no doubt have much to say about the crown's true nature. If only you could read them. Uh, thank you. Uh, I've learned more than enough. <laughs> you certainly have. Even simple knowledge of these tones is enough to stimulate most. But where is it locked away? Why can we just grab everything now? What you're looking for? No, I did not find what I'm looking for. Did you? Not a dicky bird. It's really quite disappointing. Oh, I've a good point to march up there. Once per turn, any condition of flick on the target applies to increase. When the wearer deals cold damage, for two turns and cross of frost. Firebolts, topple, it's 18. How can I help you? 
most of the tower is dead, I'm not sure he has a replacement. What will you do? The same as I've always done. I deal in knowledge, not proprietors. Quietly getting on with things is a virtue, you know. What do you have on offer? Scrolls, parchments, codices, tomes. Take a look and see what calls you. Okay, so nothing really we have interest in. Let's sell some stuff we've picked up. Tartiac Codex. I'd advise okay, to can I buy... buy books as temperamental as these are not on sale. They are secured in our vault, where none can harm them, nor can they do any harm. I'm happy to describe the wonders that lie between their covers, but I'm afraid purchasing them is simply out of the question. Let's see. I came here all the way from Neverwinter to admire your collection. Couldn't I just peek in the vault? Persuasion. Isn't it your job to share knowledge, not keep it locked away? At least tell me where the vault is. <laughs> Three and a six. Luckily, that's enough. Customers like you are why I prefer the company of books. To gain access to the vault is through my office. And before you ask, no, you are not allowed in there either. Okay. It is said to be written by Lord Cassus himself, the Netherese arcanist who attempted to replace the goddess Mistra, failed, and was banished for the attempt. Great magical knowledge lies within those pages, but not many can withstand it. The annals of Carsus would no doubt have much to say about the crown's true nature. If only you could read them. <laughs> you certainly have. Okay. So, what we are going to do. We're gonna end it here, and then when we come back, we're gonna see if we can gain access to the vault. So this is her office, which we have been in. Weird. Huh. But anyway, I hope you guys are enjoying it. Have a great day, and I'll see you.